So my beloved brothers and sisters, Allah speaks about divorce in Surah Al-Baqarah and Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala says, well, there is a way of divorcing. You divorce once. Thereafter, you may reconcile. Wow, imagine what type of comfort. It's the only teaching across the globe throughout all religions that if you were to divorce, the Almighty says, well, you can reconcile. Come back. You may. You might have realized something and you want to come back. So Allah says, And if he had divorced her, there is no harm if both of them would like to get back to each other together. That's the first divorce. So Allah says, well, if you feel you made a mistake and you shouldn't have divorced, come back, come back together. Look at the comfort Allah's giving you in times of crisis. It was a crisis. You made a mistake. You divorced someone. Allah says, hang on, we have comfort for you. What's the comfort? Get back together. But remember, when you divorce, do it the proper way. Learn how to issue the divorce. May Allah make it easy for us. Some people do the wrong thing. Then they scream for help when they cannot be helped because they were foolish in the first place. But Allah says, don't worry, we will help you. You do it the right way. We allow you to get back together. Not once, but twice, two times you can get back together. So if you made a mistake and divorced first time, come back. If you divorced a second time, you had a change of heart, something happened which was positive, you felt perhaps you wanted to get back or you thought you made a mistake. Allah says you can get back a second time. Subhanallah. Look at the power of Allah. Look at the comfort He's given us. Amazing. And this is in Surah Al-Baqarah, verse number 230. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in a beautiful way. Then Allah says, if you've divorced your spouse, don't become upset when they want to marry someone else. Make it easy for them. Let them let them go. Sometimes a person divorces and when they hear that their ex wants to get married, they start putting a spoke in the wheels and a spanner in the works and they contact the new uh, supposed spouse and begin to spread rumor and say hurtful and hateful things. Allah says, do not do that. You want comfort in your life? Let others live comfortably. It's okay. You didn't get along. They will get along with someone else. That's what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says. So he warns us. He says, don't hold them back. Don't hold a woman back in a way that she's neither married to you because you're not fulfilling her rights, nor is she divorced because you haven't issued the divorce so she cannot go to someone else. Either fulfill her rights properly or release her respectfully. That is how you will achieve comfort. Otherwise, you will be in the biggest crisis. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us from crises.